Oh my god. <sighs>you guys and welcome back to my channel um i'm vlogging for no reason at all what is up with the light is my eyes just really anyway so i'm vlogging for no reason at all i literally just got home from work and it's been a rough three days of the week i'm not gonna lie i have no idea why i'm just feeling it um i'm like really really tired and gym has been really really hard and i just feel icky. um i think what actually messed it up is that monday on my way to work i got stuck in some hectic traffic and i got stuck for almost three hours and just within the first hour i had to pee and i couldn't make a u-turn because i was like gridlocked so i had to sit for another almost two hours in traffic on the way to work with the hardest pee ever it was bad it was bad so uh that start of the week off on a glorious note it is 25 to 6 and usually i would come home and i would sit and either edit write or study and today was the day that i was supposed to sit and study and film a video but I'm so freaking tired, I don't think that's gonna happen. So I decided that I'm going to kind of vlog my just day, but it's like a middle of the week just day. But it's a get your shit together day and usually I do it on Sundays and Sundays is like the getting ready for the week, etc. But I think I'm gonna do one today, but like a mental just day. So I guess this video will be kind of like a mid-week refresh routine to kind of get your mindset on track again because it is easy to fall into a rut not long term a short term rut because you're tired you're exhausted you have a lot to do go and do the, what was the first thing on my list step one of this little mental refresh day not even a day like a few hours mental refresh evening oh that is bad lighting so step one of this little just mental refresh zen mode kind of thing is to is this focused on me no it wasn't i'm sorry so you want to clear up your space and make it all neat and fresh again because as you can see i just have clothes everywhere um uh, just have cables makeup still there so you kind of want to just refresh your whole oh another pile of clothes hey you want to clear up your space and put everything away, tidy up, so that you have a bit of a clearer mindset, I guess. I don't know, I get very agitated when my surroundings are untidy and everything's everywhere and not in its place. Have you guys ever seen a blob eat? Look at it! Just look at it! How cute can you possibly get? Hi! <laughs> okay, you're very hungry. This has been chilling here for like three days and I've been trying to throw it away for three days. But um, the oh, you fell. Dustbin is like six steps away from my damn room and I haven't thrown it away. So, step one clear up your area. Done. Yeah, I think I'm gonna make some food. It is only like half past six, six thirty. But I'm really hungry because I missed lunch today. So, I think I'm gonna eat, let my food settle, watch the last episode of The Crown, and then I think I'm gonna run. A nice hot bath and relax after that because then I don't have to worry about doing dishes and shit after a bath. I 
Actually, you know what? I need to take this lipstick off. It's killing me right now. Let me show you guys what I'm making for dinner. It's a very um, simple recipe and very easy, easy to make. Um, all you have to do, literally, you just need one thing for this recipe and it's the best thing ever. All you have to do is go to Woolworths and buy any frozen dinner that you prefer because Woolworths is the bomb. So I hope that this will be a kind of entertaining vlog of you guys seeing me just do random things but yes we are on step two and that is to make yourself a real good comfort meal whatever you feel for whether it's takeout or home cooked meal microwave food make yourself a good comfort meal to make yourself feel better another tip if you're feeling for the cold drink have the damn cold drink no, I'm lying. Don't drink cold drink. It's so bad for you. Behold my dinner, which took a good two hours to make. I mean, two minutes to make. So I just topped it off with some Parmesan and some of my mom's homemade um, chili because she grows her own chilies. And I think she's trying to kill us, but they're pretty good. It's one of the reasons why this week is going so great. Seriously, Sina, seriously. Okay, so, step three is to. What are we doing actually? It's been like a whole hour, it's like quarter to eight now. So, I'm gonna run a hot bath to soak my really really freaking sore muscles <laughs> and wash my face makeup off put a face mask on and uh, just chill there for a bit so that means that when I get out of the bath I can get straight into bed and have an early night and sleep any mini money mo we're gonna do coconut do you think you're getting a treat I'm sorry it's not a treat my baby Okay, so that's the bubbles it made. Um, I didn't realize how full the tub was getting, so I kind of just dropped it in there. And now it's fizzing up, but it's not exactly creating huge bubble. <sighs> okay, I'm back. Uh, the bath was the bomb. Whew, so I feel a lot more relaxed. I'm so freaking tired now, which is a good thing, because now I know I'm gonna sleep well, because I also have been sleeping, but waking up every night at the same time. Okay. Tip number four, that's eight. <laughs> Tip number four for kind of getting your mental shit together is to journal. So um, I'm not very good at journaling. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not consistent with that at all. But I recently just started, and when I say just started, I mean like two days ago. <laughs> using the tiny Buddha journal. So I got the gratitude journal and the worry journal. Get your thoughts all out on paper. You would be amazed at how like free your mind feels after you do that. So get your thoughts out on paper, then tuck yourself into bed, which is looking so good right now, and have a good sleep. So I'm gonna tuck myself into bed. I'm gonna do my journaling. I'm gonna go bring my cat inside. She's actually still out there. Good morning, humans. I'm not as sweaty as I probably should be. Um, today's workout wasn't all that great. So, anyway, tip number. What are we on? Five? I think we're on five. Anyway, so tip number five. I did say I was gonna let this go into the morning. So, 
First things first, I had an awesome freaking sleep. So tip number five is to get your ass up the next day and get moving and do your routine as best as you can because we all have that perfect routine morning routine in our heads but we never really play it out so my next step is to play that routine out and see how good you feel after that so um feeling pretty good gonna hop in the shower get done and i'll see you in a little bit just now and my last and final tip for you guys is to dress up make yourself feel good make yourself look good because if you look good you feel good that's honestly what i feel like when you have a bad day um i even washed my hair because i felt like i was gonna feel good if i washed my hair i don't know um yeah and then just go into the next day feeling good because you had a good rest you reset your mind you let all your thoughts out on paper you relaxed your body you the next day I had a pump running through you and now you've showered you've you know whatever you've gotten ready you ready for the day so what I'm trying to get at in this video is that your mental health is so freaking important that when you find that you are slipping in a lot of areas of your life like you slacking at work or you're not doing so great at gym or you know you you're not productive you're not you know you're studying but you're not learning you know it's just different aspects of your life where you feel like you're starting to slip that's kind of a sign that you need to step back breathe take a break and give your brain a bit of a, a snooze you know oh, my nose is freaking itchy again and it's not even the inside of my nose it's the outside of my nose i'm so hungry right now Ugh. I actually didn't have my protein shake i should go have my protein shake but i actually hate that protein shake i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up and take it easy guys be positive be happy and i will see you in my next video adios amigos